Good morning. Today we are going to demonstrate the V notch wheel. We turn on the pump. We set the bed slope equal to 1%. And we check the level. We set the point gauge at zero at the weird crotch. The width of the approach channel is six inches or 0.5 feet. Now we're going to measure the hydraulic head H over the weir. The head measurement should be taken at a distance L of at least four times the hydraulic head. We try a distance of 150 millimeters. which is less than one-fourth of 150 millimeters. In U.S. customary units, the hydraulic head is 0.0984 feet. The head to width ratio, H over B, is 0.0984 divided by 0.5, which is equal to 0.196 which is less than 0.2. Therefore, the weir is operating under fully contacted conditions. The discharge through the V-notch weir is, the discharge coefficient C sub E is a function of the angle theta of the weir. For this case, theta is equal to 90 degrees. The discharge coefficient C sub E is 0.578. The head correction K is also a function of the angle theta of the weir. In this case, for theta equals 90 degrees, the head correction K is 0.0029. Therefore, the discharge is 0.0081 cubic feet per second. This calculation can be performed using the online calculator. Thank you.